Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are flying the Mirage 2000 CS5. I just got this aircraft, so expect a lot of suffering here. It's a suck grind. In the later parts of the video, I will slowly unlock some good weaponry and other stuff. It took me a while to get this vehicle because I was really busy this past couple of weeks. But yeah, with the Mirage F1 C200, it's really helpful in grinding the French air. I think in a couple of games, I am gonna get the 2005F. So yeah, just so you know, this is post commentary. I haven't, I wasn't really recording my microphone and I was playing this. So expect some parts of the video, I am totally quiet because most likely there's nothing to say much. One more thing, I'm using a sound mod in this video and it's called Realistic Combat Sound Mod and if you want to try it out, the link will be in the description, description down below. So yeah, since I don't have the Magic 2 unlock yet, I am forced to use my guns and on this part of the video, I got really lucky with this head-on. In this part of the video, we're gonna witness another lucky moment with my gun kills because I was having issues with the ping. But yeah, I guess I just got lucky with two of my kills here. So after a good dogfight there, I decided to return to base and land because I was running out of fuel. And also the last enemy player was, I think was flying to space. I don't know what he's doing. But yeah, eventually a friendly got him. This is a good game. Yeah. 
Now we're slowly getting to the good parts. I finally unlocked the Super 530F. It's not a great missile, but it does its job. For some transparency, I did use some Golden Eagles to unlock it. I only around 50 Golden Eagles. That was a good 530 FQ. I don't really have good experience with the 530 F, so it's nice seeing it actually works. Here I went into a panic mode when I see the missile launch from the J8F. I thought it was coming for me, but it wasn't, so I should have launched my 530F there. But yeah, panic mode. Good thing I still have my magic one. And it worked perfectly. After my magic one failed to connect with the big 29, I tried to lock him on with my radar but couldn't for some reason. So I have to get close for a gun kill. And pardon the sudden cut there. I instantly saved replay because I forgot if I was saving it. Here we get a good short dog file with the 29. It's nice that I can actually keep up and also keep with the turn. Still can get a radar lag on him. I'm not sure which radar option should be should I be using for that one for close quarters. Oh yeah. Here we're gonna get some good hits. And as I was about to get a finishing move, a uh, friendly sent a missile at him. That is fine. It looks it looks it still looks awesome though. And according to my calculation, if I fly the F1C200 in 33 games, I will be able to get the 2005F. But for this video, we're gonna stick with the 2000CS5. And also on this part of the video, we have finally unlocked the Matra Super 530D. And just like before, use a little bit of Golden Eagles to get that one. Hopefully I can get these nuts. I'm just kidding. I'm bad at this joke. But yeah, here. Spoiler alert, it missed. It was so close. Then I launch again, and of course it missed just a couple of meters away, which is sad. Well, at least we brought bombs, so at least we can get some points. Even if we miss both of those missiles. And I don't have any fuse delay, so... Yep, I have to be careful. Yep. 
Yep, it sucks when both of your missiles miss three times. Actually, four times. So it's gonna take me a while to figure out how to actually fly this thing effectively. But here I tried a top down attack on the hostiles below. I really want to get a 530D kill. And here is when we get him. That's rather a good launch, good tracking, and a hit. Boom. remember getting another kill here but then I'm not sure who, which missile I was using oh yeah in order to get a good kill you have to have a good position on the enemy good positioning and good tracking here the 530d is tracking the 23 really well until I lost my radar lock but it still hit it's a critical hit and then later it's gonna go down There we go. The 23 is dead. And another splash. This is a good game. Even if I get shot down myself. Alright, that's it for the Mirage 2000 CS5. I really like this plane. It's really good. I really hope there's more camouflage options for these beautiful aircraft. I really love it. Maybe I can download some skins on War Thunder Live. Who knows? Anyway, that's it for this beautiful aircraft. We will revisit this beautiful beast in the future once I get more stuff for it. Special thanks to Sniper and Blue MP5 for being an awesome patron for this month. Thank you guys for watching and see you on the next one. Sparky is out.